Hey, hi, I'm Carol, uh, 65 this year. Uh, I'm the freelance instructor. So I do a lot of volunteers work. Yeah, I help the dementia people. I have cancer survivors to do some workouts. And I have the, my workout team. I have my have volunteer team. So this is how I, it's my life. Is life really over at 65 years old? While some may slip quietly into retirement, others choose to make their time meaningful. I have found a senior who is active seven days a week. Today, I am meeting with Carol Lim, who believes age is just a number. Monday morning, I have a stretching and workout for all senior citizens. Mm -hmm. And then Tuesday evening, I have Arabic class. Mm -hmm. Wednesday morning, I got Cancer Society Aerobic class. <laughs> Thursday afternoon, got dementia. Okay. Friday, I'm free for nine months. Okay. Uh, Saturday, I got one dori, chai tea dori ball. I see my mom sick. Then nobody can help because she doesn't want to step out of the house. Okay, seniors are a bit uh, lazy and uh, need a lot of encouragement. Mm. So this is why I how I start my volunteer work. I encourage everybody to come out of this comfort zone. Yeah. Because you, now the hell, it, I found a lot of uh, senior citizens that doesn't like to step out of the house. Before I have asthma, when I was young time, um, uh, my family, my brothers also got asthma, my sister also got asthma. So I found it's very weak. So when, when after when I start work, I got uh, people say, Feng si. when the weather's change, I feel my two legs are painful. And I start pick up my yoga. I pick up yoga, I learn yoga, then I pick up aerobics. From that, uh, my instructor say, Carol, you go for your training, you go for the courses, go ahead, you show you can. This is how people encourage me, now I encourage people. After listening to Carol, I feel inspired to get moving as well. Line dancing. Line dancing, uh, okay. You can say line dancing. Uh, uh, I'm very good uh, trainer. I've been joining her for this uh, 21 years already. If you It is amazing how Carol remains so youthful at her age. Her secret, it seems, is in the way she shares of herself with others, whether by coaching or by caring for those who cannot care for themselves. Sharing is caring is what we should all do. I'm Sidi Joe Carson, Singapore One.